Hello, my name is Davor Alc and I've, I'm working with this software for a couple of months and things that I uh, saw that many of things can be automated. So I made a script that is doing that. Uh, in this particular case, I was uh, looking for all the pathology and all the microorganisms and uh, helmets that uh, software found in each of the scanned part. And you actually do this like this, and then you click uh, here, and then you click adjust all, and then you have all of them here. And then you have to select them and then say, uh, go to the app crisis and then it's set to app crisis and app crisis is here you so you can find uh, you can see it the other thing that uh, also uh, is problematically and I will come back at the end of the movie to that when you export uh, to PDF all those things can Th that PDF can be like 100 pages and to see all those and actually uh, it's all about this number and you wanna see uh, most critical parts like uh, if some kind of parasite is really uh, there so you have to go and search for everything that goes below uh, 0 0.4 and that kind of thing can be tremendous work and a lot of work I did it a couple of times but uh, <laughs> I will never do it again thanks to this software so imagine you going for all those 220 ticks like click the next and then go here you can click the test and again uh, click pathology uh, and then click adjust all and then you again uh, click and select it and go into epic crisis and then again exit exit and go next I did it a couple of times but it's uh, <laughs> I, uh, I wish that to no one so let's say how the software uh, does that so uh, here you can see uh, there are uh, 220 scanned parts so you place that number in here and then you say okay place everything into epic crisis from those scanned parts so you hit the button and it goes you also have the press escape uh, button at any point to exit the program and it will exit now it checks the pathology microorganisms uh, and helmets and it uh, clicks on the this thing uh, is doing only first time to release some uh, software intensity then it goes to pathology microorganisms and then it's adjust all selects uh, first 20 part 20 uh, things and then hits into the set it into the app crisis and I hit exit now we are already at the second uh, part of the uh, organism of the scanned part now we are at the third and imagine this all doing like I don't know uh, it's gonna take you like two or three hours to do it by uh, clicking but as you see it's doing it by itself and you can leave it and it will be done uh, much more faster than you can do it with uh, the arm like all those clicks so in a 20 minutes you go do something else or work on the uh, other computer or 
do whatever you want in your time and this will be done so let's stop uh, this movie and continue when it's uh, done or actually we can just uh, hit the escape button and it will automatically stop what is doing for this purpose of uh, demonstration it's not needed to, to go all the way so I hit uh, escape it stops uh, now we can go to app crisis they are all of them here and then you can say make or you could say uh, export to, to the PDF uh, I'm just gonna wait till is done uh, with this uh, processing to the uh, yeah txt file and then uh, let me say let me show you how it uh, went before just click ok uh, click ok and then you can uh, go on uh, and save this it will export and like four pages and that's okay but if you have uh, done all those uh, scanned parts then you have here like 100 pages then you all go have have to go and see um, all those numbers uh, let's say here uh, dystonia vascular is like uh, 0 0.491 that is uh, problemat problematic but m how more to the zero is like 0 0.001 that kind of things you need to uh, take it as uh, first like let's say here uh, laryngitis that's the thing that uh, is uh, that has been playing right now and uh, uh, the number is 0 0.016 so this kind of things you need to have also here if we go to the microorganisms uh, we can see 0 0.44 that's okay but if he was like uh, above of like uh, here uh, 0 wait a second Uh, oh yeah. like here uh, 0, 0, 0. 0. 0.006 then you uh, wanted to see it as first and not to have to scroll all the way down and watch it and then uh, have that kind of information what I uh, also did we can show you now let's start the browser let's see let's see how you can upload all those things and have it much better view let's go to emolio.es point as okay let's give some let's say go to the this uh, thing where the mite allergy is and then you click on this and then you can say show me from the all the whole scan show me only the CSS values uh, below the 0 0.4 so you can see all the microorganisms in the uh, 
uh, scanned parts uh, at once so you can just say okay this is problematical like 0 0.068 and you can go to some frequency generator and find the frequency to eliminate this microorganism I didn't show you how to work uh, with this um, website but actually that's the, for the another video this was to show you how we can uh, have all those things fast placed in the app crisis and then we can upload this text to the website and then see all at once uh, how what parts of scanned elements are uh, critical or what kind of elements are not critical so that's it for uh, the vector and uh, placing to the epicrisis more feature will come and but subscribe and you will find out all those features thank you and bye bye